Surrey University has a long history of welcoming international students. And since there are 140 nationalities, we thought it about time to explore the subject. Uh, I'm Algerian American. I'm from China, Beijing. The sweetness makes the lover. Kazakhstan. Singapore. Greece. Cyprus. Okay, we have um, about 3,000 students at the university um, who are from outside of the UK. So we have 12,000 students in total, so about 25%. So we're about the 25th highest uh, institution in terms of our uh, international student numbers. Living in another country can be daunting, with no friends and no family. So what exactly is out there to make this town and this university comfortable for international students. International societies are one of the main ways to get started. There are currently 17 societies representing a worldwide community, but the majority of people seem to be from Greece and Cyprus. There are about um, a bit over, uh, under 2,000 Greeks and Cypriots together in the university. So the thing with Cyprus is that um, we're a small island. It's a small society in each town. For example, I'm from Limassol, it's the, it's the second biggest town, and we all know each other. So everyone tends to go and study somewhere that they already know someone from that's, that's there, so they can help him and stuff. So basically everyone ended up here, I don't know why. Also some private schools have like, um, tend to send their students here. As a president of the Cyprus Society, what do you organize? Well, we mostly organize Greek nights. We organize other events like uh, as other international societies like the I Gala exhibition nights and stuff. And we tend to like get ideas from our members, like they send us emails with ideas what they want to do, and we try to like do it. But mostly, we're trying to bring the um, Cypriot culture back here in England. It is clear that societies are a good way to find your place in uni. However, there are 140 nationalities and just 17 international societies. So the vast majority is left out in the code. So who's to blame for this? Well, you could say lack of interest, because societies are run by the students, for the students. As you might know, we've got over 140 nationalities on campus. So every year the Students' Union runs an event called International Festival, which is branded as iFestival. And we have lots of different events that go on throughout the two weeks to celebrate culture on campus, so anyone's culture. And we have um, events such as the I Exhibition, where well, this is one of the stalls that we had, and people can plot where they're from around the world to get to see where, where the students of Surrey from in the world. That's really amazing. <laughs> yeah. plenty of, plenty of lots of that. lots of different people from different countries. Yeah. And um, and yet yeah, anyone that wants to do an event or anything to promote their culture or celebrate their culture, we try and include that into the, the festival. Okay. So what was like the major events, the major one you said? The in this big week? one is um, the I exhibition, okay. which has just happened. Okay. And we had over a thousand people come to that. There was lots of free food and we had animals from around the world. Okay. We had meerkats animals. and snakes, yeah. Animals from around the like world. Real like real animals. Real animals. <laughs> okay. And um, then the other big event is the I Gala, where lots of international societies put together a performance, like a variety oh. performance, celebrating their culture. So some people do, do dances, some people do singing. So yeah, there's lots of different things going on. Okay. So if you want to find more information on how to get involved, just check out the website on www.ussu.co.uk slash ifestival. Okay, then international societies can be really helpful, but they're only a small aspect of uni life. We went to get the cold hard truth about what international students really like or dislike about them. Um, I really like the campus and I think the, the people here are really helpful, the international students. 
Zara University have the good reputation, good reputation about hotel management, okay. and then it's also good for me to learn different cultures and. Um, the main reason why I came to Surrey is uh, probably because of the location of the university. It's quite near to London, but not in the London itself. It's a lovely little town, Guildford, everything is close. And and what I feel good is the mental, they organize party every single weekend, which is good for us to get to know other students and uh, maintain a friendship. I choose Surrey because of the perspectives. Uh, they have really good perspectives. I'm doing languages, so um, the employment rate is really high, uh, like around 90% or something like that. Um, that's one of the main reasons I chose it, really. It's very good, and the people are very friendly, and they're there to help you whenever you need it. It's close to London, so I get, I get the, the quiet time when I need to study here, and I can go into London when I need some time out, and I need to have some fun. The thing I like the most here is that there are a lot of people from Cyprus as well, so I don't think homesick sometimes. Uh, the thing I hate the most is the weather. <laughs> Cut. <laughs>